Good afternoon, everyone. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com, and welcome. Welcome to the StockSwish Show, Play of the Day. This is TWGP. What a nice, nice, beautiful, fabulous golden gap. I want a great way to start earnings season. Earnings season actually starts tonight, but I feel like it started today for me because this was a great gap, and what a nice way to go into the beginning of the week. And today is only Tuesday, and earnings season starts tonight. So really good sign, great sign, and very positive, positive way to start the week. I actually held this. I had a great exit on this, too. You could still be in this. There was a second setup in this. In fact, I did call it, but I just didn't do this because you'd have to be in it all day. Here was the entry in this if you wanted to do the second setup. And then you're doing this really, the only reason you do this is if you're doing this to take it all the way down to get it down to the break of $4. $4 is 100% realistic today. It's at $4.37 the low now. And that would only be a buck something. So if you didn't do this here, there's nothing to do. I highly doubt this has another setup in it. And again, you'd have to do this and be in it until 4 o'clock, wherever it goes to the number. I actually think this breaks $4 today. This is a beautiful gap. This might actually not fall, though, into the close. It's just bleeding down there. It's just waiting to go. It could very well drop down to 350 and drop another dollar. I just don't feel like sitting here all day waiting for this. And I had a great, great, great trade this morning. I love doing gaps where I have 100% conviction. And I had 100% conviction in this today. This actually uh, was helped somewhat by the market because the market fell on through today. But I would have done this today as aggressively as I did, irregardless of the market. If the market was in a power bullish uptrend today, I would have shorted this thing as aggressive as I was today in any regard. I had an absolutely perfect entry with an absolutely perfect stop and a perfect exit. Now, you know, the first target I was looking for this was 450. And then when it didn't break there, I was all out. Again, this has broken 440, but you would have to retake this as a secondary trade and be in it. And the thing is that, you know, with these types of gaps, there was so much volume in this in the morning that it actually acted perfectly considering with the volume in it what I wanted it to do. Uh, and I was right on top of it. was talking about this earlier today. It is so, so, so important when you trade to be deliberate. In fact, you have to be if you're taking size, but even if you're not taking size, you should practice in your head the same way. Even if you only take 100 shares of something or 200 shares of something or 300 shares of something, you should be deliberate when you press the button. If there's hesitation on your part, it's not good. It, hesitation kills a cat. You do have to be deliberate. Deliberate in your trade. I'm very deliberate when I take the action. Boom, boom, I'm in, I take it, stop over the number. And that's it. And then you're in. You have to be deliberate in your entries. That's what conviction is all about. And you do have to have conviction. It was funny. I read something today on some website. Someone was talking about the importance of having conviction and saying that he didn't have conviction in the market, but he was in some market trade. I'm thinking, why would you be in a trade if you didn't have conviction? I have conviction in everything I do or I wouldn't press the button. And this is part of being deliberate in your actions. Deliberation, conviction, confidence, self-control, self-reliance, all of these things are required. Trust me when I say the market will absolutely smell fear if you are afraid to press the button if you're wavering or if your hand is flinching or if you're not sure of the uncertainty. The market will smell that. Okay, so don't, don't, don't go there. Here was a beautiful move I got. I got this whole thing. And here's where I got out. So this last couple of bit here, I just didn't want to redo it. But you certainly could have. And it actually had the entry. It rallied and barely could rally it off. It barely could get a breath of life. But it, you know, it's set up. I mean, look at the 13, the 30 minute here. No, this isn't ready to go again yet. Wow, every 60 minute bar here looks terrific. Look, down, 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 down. So if you didn't if you if you're not in this from the 15 minute, which I think is the only other entry it's gonna give, it might give one more entry by two o'clock, but I doubt it. This little rally in here was it. I mean it just proves that how weak this is. And it's to the double bottom here and then broke broke right in here into this bar here at 1130. 
And again, even if the market comes into support today and bounces, that isn't going to affect this. This is just devastation here for this thing. So I actually did see this last night. I, I, I saw it yesterday morning. We we're going over things that said I really like this. And then it did it, and I saw it last night, and I said, yeah. And again, this is what helps me be deliberate in my actions for taking trades. And the stock makes it easy for you. I always tell people, do something that works. When you're fighting against something and fighting against something, then it, you know, then how do you have conviction and it's not working? Let the trade come to you. Let the stock give it to you. Let the gap give it to you and you know that it works and you do it. Short weakness and buy strength. That's the right way to play the market. And this was a beautiful thing today. Absolutely perfect gap. And this is TWGP. This is the Stock Swiss Show Play of the Day. Great way to start earnings season October 8th. And we'll see what we get tonight, tomorrow morning. If anyone's interested in doing the Golden Gap class this weekend, it is October 12th and 13th. You can email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a fantastic day, everyone. An absolutely fantastic, beautiful fall day. And earnings season is here. Have a good one.